Grunfeld defense, Burel variation, 5, C66.B2007.00. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. White took advantage of the opportunities they saw in the opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. d5 establishes a presence in the center, controls the e4 square, and opens up the light squared bishop. The queen's gambit offers up a wing pawn to attack the center and distract black from the e4 square. In the Slav defense, c6 supports the d5 pawn. And c3 attacks the d5 square and starts the fight for the e4 square. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. It is good. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is the last book move. That's fine. It is good. A very strong play. It is excellent. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is good. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. It is best. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. It is excellent. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. This kicks an opposing bishop. It is good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. White had an advantage, but now the game is close to equal. It is a mistake. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is best. This develops a queen off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. That's not a mistake but it's not the best move either. It is good. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is excellent. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks a better way to recapture a piece. It is an inaccuracy. This reveals an attack on a queen. It is good. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is good. This attacks a bishop, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to safety. This threatens to take an outpost with a knight. It is best. This challenges the opposing rook for control of the open file. It is excellent. This adds pressure by pinning a knight. It is best. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is good. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. This threatens to fork pieces. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This stops the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. 
This is the only move that works. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures, from a previous move. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This forks multiple pieces. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to move a rook to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This is the only move that works. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is a great move. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is excellent. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to activate a rook by getting it to the seventh rank. It is a mistake. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. It is best. This moves the knight to safety. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. White took advantage of the opportunities they saw in the opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. White took advantage of the opportunities they saw in the opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players.